So the vending machines are already in Fortnite Battle Royale. It's a little bit strange because normally all the updates come out on Thursdays, but it actually came out today on a Wednesday. I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm down to go into the Battle Royale field and start finding me some vending machines. So here we go. There's also new game modes, by the way, high explosives on solo and squads. I really do feel like they're trying to make all these new limited time modes um, not just for squad, but for solos and eventually maybe even duels. I think that's going to be really, really fun. High explosives on solo. I, <laughs> I really do feel that's going to be amazing. I guess now we can truly see the vending machine and see if it's actually overpowered or, or, or if it's fair or if it needs some tweaking. I don't know. We'll see. So I'm getting reports that it's kind of like chess. That they do have a uh, kind of like a location where they spawn. They're just not always consistent. So they do have specific spawns, but they're not consistent. So think of, uh, think of them as chest. So we're going to go to Salty Springs here. And I know, I even called it. I knew there was going to be one around the gas station. And I'm getting reports that there's one here in the gas station. There's a bunch of them. Like, there really is a bunch of them. They, they Some of them will spawn in, like, like the middle of the field. Some of them will spawn the, inside a broken house. See, right now, there's not one in here. And that's a crossbow. And that, that really blows. All right. So... We're gonna see if we can find our vending machine somewhere else because it is definitely not here i'm gonna start har harvesting some materials as soon as i get my weapons ready we're gonna start getting some materials here all right sweet here we go oh it's already some action going on here where is that I think it's on the uh, treehouse. That's gotta be treehouse. Don't kill each other, guys. Not just yet. I need to get I need to get sorted first, okay? All right, now you can go ahead and try and uh, kill yourselves, cause I am gonna be opportunistic and come for that win. All right, somebody died in there. <laughs> Sorry, dude. <laughs> All right, let's go. We are loaded. Okay, where do we go? Let's get out of here. I'm trying to find myself the vending machines before I get killed. Do your vending machines. Where are you? By the way, there is a brand new weapon update. As you can see, now you have 100% accuracy with several weapons. If you do not move, it's the burst weapon, uh, the uh, assault rifle. So ARs, um, assault rifles like burst rifles. Here we go. Oh. Look at that. 100% accuracy. I really like that. He's dead. He's dead. Sweet. I like that. You know why? Because it, it kind of closes the skill gap more. And you, you don't have any more of that uh, blooming effect, which is basically inconsistent shots. He's right here, guys. All right, he's over there. Who the fuck is this guy? Do you have any C4s around here? All right. You want to play rough? You want to play rough? Come on.
Oh my goodness. Good, finally. Found myself a chug jug. I'm gonna heal up. Crap. I'm gonna heal up and then we're gonna go see if we find this uh this vending machine here. Supposedly there's a bunch of them. Just gotta see if I find one. We will find one. I'm sure we will. But yeah, there's a bunch of weapons now with the 100% accuracy. I don't know if you guys recall when they did that for um when they did it for the uh, shooting test one. And uh, they didn't put the effects immediately on the game because I guess they wanted to see, you know, if they had to do any further testing. It also does come with a weapon drop off damage. So now like you won't have, like, you'll have the, the, the privileges and, 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 and perks of being able to do 100% accuracy with certain weapons. And um, therefore, if you're a good player with good aim, then that's gonna benefit you, of course. And you don't get any more of them cheap shots by players that um, are probably not as good as you or whatnot. And it only does work just the first shot and then you'd have to reset yourself again for it to work again but that's how it works it also comes with a uh, weapon damage drop off percentages for uh different weapons and whatnot so it definitely is a step in the right direction oh look at this this is this is kind of cute right here bro shit i like it take this why not Okay, vending machine, vending machine, where are you? Vending machine, I'm trying to find you. Ooh, there's one right there. Oh! And it's a legendary. Oh my God, it's a legendary. Dude. Yo, this is insane. 500. I don't even have 500. Okay. Ooh. Get wrecked, noob. Okay. Let me see. Does this guy have 500 wood? I mean, I guess it's not that bad. I mean, I don't even have 400 wood or 500 wood right now. <laughs> Can you break them? Oh, if you hit them, they switch quicker. And you cannot break them? Are you serious? So this one has... Oh, and you could buy them with materials. 500. If I wanted a sniper, I need to get... Dude, that's insane. They take wood, metal, and brick. Okay, so how do I get... How do I get metal? That's the thing. Fuck, there's no metal around here. Well, it's nothing crazy. Like, it's not like it's an RPG. So we have one right there. Which is kind of cool. Ooh, I hit him. See, that's a 100% accuracy thing. That's what it is. Let's go, baby. Okay, sweet baby Jesus. All right, so we have 500 wood. See, the thing is that it has it has weapons I don't need though. So, but what happens when you get it? That's what I want to know. Like, how does it dispense the the machine? How does how does it dispense the weapon for you? Let's see if we find another one here. I've also seen that they do bring uh, minis and they bring mech kits and they bring all sorts of stuff. So it's it's used for a bunch of things. Okay, so there's gonna be a dude here. Oh shit. Damn, potato aim hollow over here. God damn. Okay. All right, sweet. See, I have a thousand wood now, so 
If I find something, I don't know what happened with my aim there. <laughs> if I find something that probably has a make it, I can take it. Let me see if our fatal field has so something like that around here. I might as well just go get that that um, shotgun, to be honest. Let me see. The one that we found earlier was basically by where, by where the uh, shrines were. The Chinese shrines. That's where it was. Oh, this is metal. We can get metal right here. Oh, we have 600 metal. We could probably get the sniper. Yeah, we can get the sniper. You know, I feel like the uh, the hand cannon is gonna be so useful now. Dude, I didn't get I didn't get the blue AR back there. Oh wow. Thank God I got this blue burst though. I thought I got it. <laughs> I thought I had found it back there. Is there a sort of vending machine here? There is a shield here. This is great. Get out of here, bro. Alright, sweet. <coughs> We're gonna take this. I feel like the 100% accuracy gives you now, um, like, it makes you want to wonder, like, do I take the shield? I mean, do I take the hand cannon or do I take, you know, or do I take a sniper? Because the hand cannon now gives you 100% accuracy. But then again, I mean, the hand cannon does not deal the same amount of damage that that would deal. You know what I mean? So, that a sniper would deal. Oh, crap. I only got one mini. Fuck that. I'm going to take this. All right. Let's see if we can go for the for the for the vending machine over there. The the vending machines. If I, if there's some spots here that I haven't found the vending machine, doesn't necessarily mean I won't find it on the next one. So remember, those all the spots are not um, the same. They they will alternate, spot to spot. They will change. All right. Let's see if there's a vending machine somewhere around here. If there isn't, then we'll just go to. We'll just go to the other spot. I just saw one around here on Twitter. Somebody tweeted me. One of you guys tweeted it to me. Here we go. See, this is a shooting test in effect right here. I'll take the hand cannon. I'll sit still. And it'll sh it'll hit him because of the 100% accuracy. That's why he hit me in the first place. I wanted to try it out. But I guess it worked out fine. There's no vending machine around here, I see. Okay. Vending machine? Anywhere around here? Don't know. They're not going to be as common as chests. Which is a good thing. But you will see more of them than, than you see llamas. That'd be insane. You come across a llama and then you come across a vending machine. You imagine? That's a come up right there. But the thing is here that this is what people don't understand. It's, it's, I feel like now it might be a fair trade-off. They might need to be a little bit harder though. Either harder to find or probably just harder to... Or, or more materials. Uh, make the materials a little bit more. Just because they do give you some good shit. But a lot of people don't understand that this game is really, really high... And important on um see that's the shooting test. Yep. All right. So here we go. I'm going to take this. Shit's getting crazy now. I'm going to take this med kit and take those minis after. All 
Now, where's the vending machine? I don't even need it, but... I'm screwed. I'm screwed. This is fucked, dude. Trying to find his damn vending machine here. gonna die here this is the vending machine <laughs> by the way <laughs> um should we trade some stuff just to see it does he know I'm here okay this is fucking great I don't need any of those stuff though, that's the thing. You little shit bag. Like, do you think I need any of this? No. I don't need it. <laughs> oh, there's five people left, dude. I shouldn't even be doing this right now. actually a pretty good game ah. it's okay we can wait to another one to um I'll show you guys opening the uh, vending machine it's okay if I don't get it in this game which most likely we'll see we could find one This is not good. Oh, wow. Do I have a launch pad? Yes, I have a launch pad.
Oh. Dig that shit! What? 14 kills, dude. That was a good game. Um, I'm gonna see if I can open one. I just didn't want to open one because there was really nothing that I didn't need. Like, that I needed. I'm sorry. I'm gonna go open one right now. Alright, so here we go. We're gonna go to Retail Row and um, see if we find one here. Retail Row has to have simply because I've seen it on Twitter. And two, it's a big mall. So. I mean, it's kind of silly if they wouldn't put a vending machine in retail row. Oh, there's one. I already see one. There's already one over there. I see it. Just like that, I spotted one already. I already spotted one. Okay. Sweet. So what we have to do now is gather some wood, right? Gather some wood. We don't gather wood. And what's the point? Let's open up this. Pallets are always an essential, essential what? An essential part of this breakfast. Today's breakfast menu is vending machines. Hoping I don't get spotted and get smoked out. Okay, so there's a vending machine right here. There it is. It's got a regular burst. SMG. What up? Sorry, my dude. Okay. So that's one vending machine. It's right there. Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. <laughs> the other one that spawns right here is not here right now. See, this one has that. If you hit it, it'll tell you all the options. It only has two of them, which that's kind of whack. We're going to go to this mountain top here. Let's see if we have a vending machine up here. We might, we might not. All right. No vending machine here today. That blows. We'll go to Snake Way. Okay, the snake way. Oh, there's one in snake way. Let's do it. There's one in snake way. Here we go. It's a better one, so we can do that. I just want to see how it works. You know what I mean? It's the same thing for legendary, rare, epic, common. It doesn't matter. It's just I want to see how the weapon pops out. You know? So these could be used as bait really badly, <laughs> I feel. So right now, let's say I have a regular burst. I mean, a regular AR, and I, and I want to burst with 300 wood. It just pops out. They just gave me that though. I didn't really want that. Like, what the fuck, bro? I need metal. That's what it is. Oh, but that's cool. Like, it just poops it out. Like, here, man. And there you go. <laughs> you gotta do it quick. 
I don't have enough brick. Okay, can I get brick? Is there any brick around here? This is actually not bad, man. It really isn't. It's not that bad. It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I mean, it could be bad. There, I'm sure there's going to be parts where you're literally going to get screwed due to the uh, due to the vending machine favoring somebody that has a lot of materials and they get like crazy RPG and then you're screwed. And I'm an idiot. I don't have enough bricks yet. Can I get stone from this? Oh, yeah, I can. Dude, I'm so close. What the hell? Oh, maybe this has stone. I'm gonna go get the stone before um <laughs> before it goes to waste. Just so we can dispense one more item from this. Alright. Alright. So With ammo and everything? Damn! Oh, that was pretty cool. Not gonna lie. That was okay. The glitch. Fuck. We still haven't fixed the glitch. There we go. Now I have a blue a blue burst. I really feel like that's OP right there. Like a blue burst, only 300 brick. I don't know, bro. That's dangerous. But guys, that's gonna be it for this video. Brand new vending machine. Some gameplay. We got a victory royale with 14 kills. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you guys want me to do a locations. All the locations known so far for the vending machines, make sure you guys leave a like on this video and I'll bring that video right after this one. So you guys basically know where to go and which are the best spots. As always, thank you for tuning into the channel. I'll catch you guys in the next video.